Hello beautiful viewers domiciled throughout the cosmos, feast your eyes and sheer entertainment because today another captivating unboxing video is about to transpire. What do I be unboxing? What do I be opening? Without further delay, without further procrastination, let me render the contents of the envelope transparent. Here we go. The envelope is about to get ravaged. Bear with me. It will take me billions of picoseconds to decimate the envelope. Alrighty, I have elicited the illustrious video game from the envelope, which is known by the moniker of Injustice Gods Among Us Ultimate Edition for the PlayStation 4. Is this video game a paradigm perfection? Did it warrant the premium price? Did it merit the premium price? I believe so. I'm an avid, devout DC Universe fan. I relish being able to play as my favorite DC characters in a fighting game. I possess Injustice Gods Among Us for the Xbox 360. However, I lack the Ultimate Edition. Without the Ultimate Edition, you're confined to not being able to utilize the DLC characters unless you purchase them via Xbox Live. So, had I opted to purchase the characters via Xbox Live as opposed to purchasing the game, I would have paid a greater premium to procure them in the game. This game cost me a flat rate of under $12. In hindsight, I have no qualms about my decision. I have no regrets. Why not, you may ask? Well, It's much more affordable to purchase the Ultimate Edition as opposed to purchasing the DLC, and I love to revel in playing stupendous, enthralling, captivating, extraordinary, remarkable video games. Is this video game the quintessential fighting game for the PlayStation 4? It may be, that's subjective. Here we have the CD case. It's missing the original default case that it came with and the manual. However, I was not going to pay additional money to obtain those items when I could have just procured the disc for under twelve dollars. Here's the front of the disc and here's the other side. The disc does not appear to be marred with scratches. It's not tainted. The integrity of the disc has not been compromised. This is likely a Blu-ray disc, so I presume that it's scratch resistant, just like other Blu-ray discs. So, with the caveat of a receipt, that's everything I received, a generic mundane CD case, and the PlayStation 4 disc for Injustice Gods Among Us, the Ultimate Edition. This disc is preordained to disintegrate, so it will not be tangible forever, which is unfortunate. I hope that I can preserve the video game for my lifetime. However, if it gets ravaged before I succumb to death, then that will be unfortunate. But by that point, maybe I'll be able to replace the game in the event that it ceases to work and if it malfunctions then perhaps I'll opt to play another game instead so 
I do not need to ponder about the future. I do not need to contemplate about all the possibilities. I'll implement decisions that are relevant to me and abstain from implementing decisions that are irrelevant. So, pondering about the future is asinine at the moment. It has no bearing on the now. Here's everything once again. Would you have implemented the same purchase and decision that I did? Or would you have forgo the opportunity to procure a copy of this game for under $12? Please let me know. The game was $11.95. I doubt it was a penny more. Since I received 2% cash back with my credit card, it um, further reduces the price to slightly under $11.95. I also receive eBay bucks every time I procure items via eBay. Since I can redeem the eBay Bucks certificate, it also gives me an incentive to purchase items via eBay. The prospect of being able to redeem eBay Bucks certificates is quite enticing. It gives me cause to opt to buy items via eBay as opposed to other virtual retailers. So here's everything. I'm done ranting, I'm done raving, I'm done pontificating. This game is decent in all facets. The controls are cumbersome to master. However, if you have an aptitude for mastering controls, then this game will likely tickle your fancy since you can demolish your opponents in ranked Xbox Live matches if you understand the controls in depth and know how to execute combos eminently. If you do not know how to subdue your opponent's moves, if you do not know how to consecutively execute combos, if you lack knowledge about the game's mechanics, then you're apt to get trounced in ranked Xbox Live matches. So meticulously analyze the game's controls and strive to master them, hone your skills so that you can emerge victorious and ascertain victory in ranked Xbox Live matches. Here's the disc once again. I'm done repeating myself. I'm repeating myself to no avail. I've stated everything that I intended to spew from my vocal folds. I hope that you found this video to be enthralling and insightful. Have a wonderful, marvelous day. Goodbye.